Um, so pretty new room, new guys in that secondary. What are you seeing from that group as a whole? Uh, I'm seeing the growth throughout uh, summer and fall camp as well. We're getting better each and every day. Uh, Coach Powell doing a great job to teaching us in our ways, like finding ways to teach each and every ind individual. So yeah. What was that like having him back and I guess maybe the energy he brings and everything? Uh, I just feel like Coach Powell can relate to us because he's not like as an old school coach. So like he brings a lot of juice. He, we feed off him. So his energy help us get through a lot. So I want to thank you for him. Anzo, what's your focus been in, in terms of taking that next step from guy who gets playing time to guy who really is one of the keys of the defense? Uh, honestly, I'm just taking it one day at a time. If I'm a role player, I'm going to be the best role player I could be. If I'm a starter, I'm going to just try my best to be the best starter I can be. So just one day at a time, honestly. What is bringing Bryson back to the secondary done for you guys as a group? What does he bring? Uh, bringing Bryson back, it brings growth, honestly, because we're a young group. So with Bryson being here, with his knowledge and his wisdom, he's pouring it into us. So we're just taking advantage of it each and every day. I asked Devin, does he still get the newbie treatment since he's a new secondary guy, or does he get the seven-year veteran? Seven-year veteran. <laughs> he's not, he not a young dude no more. Does he, does he leave that room, or is there multiple leaders in that secondary group? I feel like it's neutral, but when it comes to certain things, B Jack is the leader of the group. What about the cornerbacks, Alfonso? What do you see from those guys? And how do you see them growing? Cornerbacks group, I see uh, individuals growing each and every day. I see Tevin Williams taking steps each and every day. Chateau, Carl Williams, Caden Jenkins, even the new guys that just enrolled this year as well. So we're all just taking it one day at a time, getting our, our communication better growing with each other and just building with each other each and every day. Alfonso, in a world where I even think a lot of people look at a young group and be like, well, they have inexperience. What's the flip side, the excitement, extra thing that, that a young group can bring? You never know. We don't have no, you, it's nothing that you can really like know what we're going to do. It's just, we're just going to come and shock you. Do you feel like you've kind of shown that in camp? Like, because I've seen you guys, you are, a lot of contested catches, that kind of thing. I mean, you guys are really tight in coverage. You, or maybe not surprising, but are you, you seeing it in camp, you guys taking steps, I guess? Uh, yes, sir. Yes, indeed. Uh, um, it first, it starts off with the young guys, Caden Jenkins, Carl Williams coming in, making big plays. And you have Chateau, Tevin feeding off of there, also making big plays. And then the secondary, we just handling business. So we all just playing together right now, one heartbeat.